Single Phase Grid Tie Inverter Installation Guide Our grid tie inverter with excellent performance and efficiency to convert solar energy to AC power, generate more electricity, then bring higher yield to customers. Inverter can be monitored on app with network connected. Customers can also manage their plants remotely. This video will guide you the installation of inverter, including steps, preparation before installing, inverter installation, electrical connection, communication accessory, power on inverter, and commissioning. Unpacking carton and take inverter out, let's have a look at inverter connectors first. From left to right, we could see DC switch to cut off PV input power, PV terminals to connect PV string for 2 to 3.6 kilowatts inverter. There is one pair terminal. For 4 to 6 kilowatt inverter, there are two pairs terminal. Communication port 2 for RS-485 or CT or meter communication. Communication port 1 to install Wi-Fi or GPS communication module. AC terminal, the output port connect to grid, grounding terminal, to install grounding wire and the vent valve. At the same time, following packing list to check inverter accessories. Expansion screws group to install rear panel on wall. Rear panel to mount inverter. Screws to tighten inverter with rear panel. PV connectors group and its unlock tool. AC connector, Wi-Fi module, RS-485, optional and some file documents like quick manual and quality certificate. Besides, here introduce other tools required for installation. Hammer, drill, adjustable wrench, socket wrench, nipper pliers, diagonal pliers, wire stripper, crimping pliers, cross screwdriver, straight screwdriver, multimeter, DC terminal tightening tool, Inverter must be installed at the place where it is free from direct exposure of sunlight, rain, and snow, with enough space and good cooling condition to ensure performance and longer lifetime. Taking out rear panel and install it on wall or bracket. Mount inverter to rear panel and tighten the screws of both sides. Wiping off insulation layer of ground cable. Tighten the cable into OT terminal. Removing the screws of inverter ground terminal, install the ground cable. Wiping off insulation layer of AC cables. Loosening the prevention nut of AC connector. Cross cables through nut and connector. Finding poles matching with each cable. Loosening screws of each pole. And insert cables. Then tighten screws. Please ensure screws are not excess the surface to affect connector combination. combining all parts of connector together. Tighten the prevention nut by wrenches. Inserting connector to inverter AC terminal and lock it well. Identifying PV connectors, the positive and negative ones, as well as metal connectors matching to them. Wiping off insulation layer of PV cables. Crimping them well with metal connectors by pliers. Please pay attention the crimping limiter on positive metal connector. Loosening the prevention nuts of PV connectors. Cross crimped cables through nuts and insert them to connectors until click sound. Then lock nuts well. 
measuring and checking voltage and polarities of PV string by multimeter. Inserting strings to inverter corresponding PV terminals until a click sound. Removing screws and plate of communication port 1. Insert Wi-Fi GPRS module, then install screws back. Wiping off insulation layer of communication cables. Loosening prevention nut and cross cables through it and cover. Install cables on connector. Removing screws and plate of communication port 2. Insert connector to a terminal. Lock nut well and install cover back on communication port 2. Check wires of PV, AC, and communication are all connected well. Turn on AC switch in distribution box. Turn on DC switch of inverter. Inverter LED indicator will be on. When inverter start up, customer can connect to inverter on app to monitor inverter data and status or configure Wi-Fi and other settings. Please refer our app video for detail guide.